Okay, hello, welcome. Uh, so, I have been trying for a quite a while to get back into this game. The servers are kind of balked at the moment. Uh, okay, a goat. Uh, that's not a good sign. So, the databases for Day Z basically hit. Uh, one million characters and I think that was its limit and basically if you died you wouldn't be able to play again until they fixed it. So they rolled out some hot fixes and whatnot but the problem is not every not every server is updated and there's a whole host of weird weird uh, issues that have uh, arisen so holy crap there's a lot of zombies over there. So yeah it's been a little bit of a a battle to get back on here. Um, I'm still in this little tower. I'm still cold, although apparently running around will help that. Now, before I go anywhere, I just want to check out this this area. I've just realised there's no actual crosshair on this server, so if I'm going to shoot, I'm going to have to make sure I aim really well. What was that? Come on, steady up. So, okay. Hey, the barbed wire's gone, so why was the barbed wire there in the first place? That is really weird. Do I have all my gear? Because I heard people have had some issues. I had to drink the last of my water. I don't think I've got any more water. Nope, I've got some Pepsi and whatnot. No, Coke. Uh, okay, okay, so. I've got two rounds, uh, two magazines of the uh, 1911. For the 1911, I've got some bandages. We've got chem lights. Uh, what else? Painkillers. I heard that morphine. I heard that morphine warms you up. So look. Oh, okay, well that's wrong. I thought it might have uh, helped me uh, steady my aim, but apparently not. So okay. <laughs> There's a ghost. That's just weird. So, whoa. What I need to do, I mean, I'm in a bad spot, I'm in a hot spot here, and it's kind of like prime time for Europe at the moment. I've been kind of playing later in the day and going on other servers just because that was the time I, you know, actually was able to get on. But, uh, I'm on basically prime time or get into prime time for Europe players so I'm gonna be careful now I do want to what the f those sounds are really freaking me out Okay, I'm scared. Cuz 
So this place is empty. Okay, so what I want to do before I leave this area, I want to check out the hangars again. Which might be a bit of a challenge today. So, okay. This was my game plan because I'm kind of. <coughs> I kind of have no bearing at the moment. I wanted to hit up. Well, I don't know where I'm going. I just need to find a map, but. Without, you know, without having one, it's kind of dangerous and silly to just cross country. So, what I've been thinking is once I've checked these hangars out, I'm going to carry on east and go to the. Go to the, uh. The, uh, what you call it, the uh, coast, and just travel along the coast all the way down and around because there's like three major cities on the coast, and I'm on the east, I think I'm on the northern east corner, so I've got a long trek via the coast, and it's going to be very dangerous. But I think I'd rather risk that danger and have some fun, you know, trying to survive rather than <coughs> traveling uh, through a stupid forest because the forest is kind of bare although I could probably survive better there now because I have the hunting knife I don't see any gear in here at all that's disappointing <coughs> I hope my coughing doesn't alert these uh, zombies <coughs> Alright, you know what? I could probably sneak past, but I'm curious. So in the in one of the previous patches they did it so flares could be uh could be used in the daylight to attract zombies. So what if we take the flares? Although this is gonna be a big uh hey everyone else, I'm over here. Whatever. So I've I've got the flare. Look, man, I got the flare in my hand. There we go. And we're gonna launch it. There we go. Did the zombies miss it? <coughs> Gone a week a week throw. Ah, too weak. So that isn't working. What else do I have? Do I have a smoke grenade? I thought I did. <coughs> that works. <coughs> I should throw it a bit further away. <laughs> so it attracted them to. Oh shit. Oh shit, took a few more away from me, but oh well. I've basically lit up this area for any players uh, who are around. So yeah, that's disappointing. The hangar's empty. It's bare. Oh, what's we'll that in the corner? Perhaps I should have checked the other corner a bit better. What do we have? Oh, sweet. That is exactly what I want. As soon as it picks it up. And we'll take the coke, because I'm going to need something to drink. So I think that was a draw distance <laughs> issue. Uh, I'm going to head back into the other hangar quickly and then we're going to get the hell out of here. <laughs> 
to like, go to the background still. I could actually test out uh, hunt my hunting knife, but you actually need a fire to uh, cook anything like that. Okay, so this hangar was a bust. The only other thing I could do was log out and log in on a different server to check <laughs> it again. But at this point, I don't care. Holy crap. So. I also need to replenish my blood, and I believe I can do that by eating meat, but... But there isn't really any... Again, I need matches so I can make a fire. There was that big town, but I think I've passed it. It was behind me. So I'm just going to keep heading east and I should hit the coast and then... I'm in the open here, that's not good. Actually, I see that over there. We'll check that out. My temperature is going up, which is a really good thing. Is that? Nah, I'm not sure. I was just debating. Apparently, running warms you up, but this is kind of like a big open area. I don't really want to run, but I think I'm away from any zombies. Oh no, oh, I'm not. I'll tell you what, the zoom in feature in this game is really good. It makes things look a lot closer than what they are. And I'm, I don't mean in terms of. Uh, I just mean that some games, when you zoom in, you can tell everything sort of. <laughs> everything looks different than it would be if you're just at your regular uh, field of you know, vision, but everything's very clear when you're like zooming in, which is kind of cool. <coughs> and you sometimes don't realise you have it on. <coughs> Alright, I'm just going to sprint because I'm going to see how much it increases my temperature, if it increases it at all. Actually, no, there could be zombies behind this place. Increase it by one. I'm hoping the temperature goes up, I'll get a steadier aim, and then after that I'm just going to be careful and try and do my best to keep it up. Okay, you can't enter this place. That was a bit of a bust. Okay, so what is around us? Do I see anyone? I don't know what city they're talking about. <coughs> Let's just run through here a little bit. I mean, unless the zombies on your tail, there's no... I don't think you should ever just sprint like this, but... Uh, at the same time, I would like to get my temperature back up because having like shaky first person is kind of lame. <laughs> and coughing all the time. Although, 
I wonder if I'm going to retain the shakes even when I'm warm because I'm, I've got this gold. I wonder if it works like that. Hey, check that out. Got some sort of big tower over there. Okay, that isn't actually warming me up too much. So what is up there? Oh, I'm going to check it out. I'm on my way to the coast. I'm trying to keep an eye out for a map, so any place I can go scavenge, I'm going to check it out. Uh, someone firing a sniper at <coughs> airstrip. Now, there's three airstrips. <coughs> I'll try talking in. Nah. So apparently they've released another beta patch for uh, for um, Armor 2, and uh, I'm assuming it's to do with the popularity of DayZ. But apparently it fixes the uh, direct communication bugs. So if you're standing next to someone and you use basically the voice. <laughs> whoever's next to you will hear you. So I really hope that is the case because I would love for that to uh, be the main focus of conversing in-game. I mean, out of game comms are kind of nice, but I like the idea of... So I'll just check if there's no sniper up there. I like the idea of being able to, you know, keep it all realistic in-game. Because you know you don't have you don't have to listen to everyone. It could be two people standing a little further away and just conversing while you and someone else are sorting, you know, are, are working on other things. Okay, we have one hopper. I did see one walker. There's the walker. I'm tempted to climb up there and just see what I can see, but what is that gonna what good is that gonna do me? Yeah, it might be cool. <coughs> but what's gonna happen I'm gonna go up there and the zombies are gonna walk back and then they're gonna sort of be hanging around here when I need to get down. Not sure what that was. Oh, and they fixed the pistol <laughs> ladder bug, so I shouldn't die climbing this. Well, this does put me out in the open now. Crikey. Whoa! Oh god, oh god. Oh. <coughs> Why can't I just stand on the ladder till I wanted to get off? Tell you what, though, if I do get shot at from here, I'm in a very bad spot. Because where am I going to go? Still, if I was a bandit, this would be pretty fun. Oh my god, don't fall down that hole. God damn, check out the view. Hell yeah. So I want to go to the coast. There we go, there's water. At least I think that was water. It sure looks like there's a river, or, or is that a road? It's because they got the fog, you see. But it looks like the coast may be there. There's a lot of forest I need to cover still. 
Um, <laughs> so, what do I see? Ah, there's the airstrip. Man, someone could have been watching me from here. That's kind of freaky. Like, the draw distance doesn't really show you... <coughs> okay. Okay, so, I need to go that way. Luckily for me, there's a lot of cover, cover for, from trees and whatnot, so... I'm just wondering if I should take out any of these zombies. How many do we have? We've got one, two... Three... Three visible zombies. Now, if I if I shot any of them, that would just be for the sake the sake of shooting them. I think they're far away enough I can sneak away. If needed, I'll just uh, pull out the 1911. That will do me. And <laughs> don't drop down ladder. <laughs> okay, um... Okay, let's get down from here. I think we're good. But we know where we're going. I'm going to hit the coast and basically travel back down to where I started with any luck. <laughs> but move all the way around to the big towns. At least that is my plan. So yeah, this will be uh, a fairly interesting <laughs> travel experience. I have no problem with being out here in the middle of nowhere because the goal is to survive, but I don't know. If I'm going to be paranoid, I'd rather be paranoid in a place where I have reason to be paranoid. Because there's very, I mean, there's still a chance of me running into someone out here, but there's a very little chance of that. Whereas, if I was in a the city, then yes, there's a, a lot higher chance, so I've got something to look out for. Because, I I mean, I don't mind going through the forest and whatnot, but if I'm going to do that, I would like a map. Because <coughs> running blind is not fun, and I don't really want to... I don't really want to, um... use a, a third party uh, map or web browser or anything like that. We've got a house down there, but what's that? Right, let's get a bit close up, there's some rabbit. Hmm, I just had a thought, you cannot refill the uh, water bottles at the coast anymore. Military truck. I wonder if this is part of that city. No, I doubt it. 
Don't see anything anywhere I can enter in there. But I wonder if I could find me a water pump. <laughs> So I need to refill my uh, canteen. One walker, one crawler up in front. as quickly as possible. Yet to see a... Dangerous, can't see past all this brush. <coughs> Dude, stop coughing, that is freaking me out. This is a bad spot, I'm going to alert him, I know it. I don't have as much blood as I did originally, but... I do, ha however, have more ammo. So I feel <coughs> safer knowing that. Keep eyes on him. Water pump, stop coughing. This is how I, I would have expected you know, all the cars to be, although this isn't like uh, some big, you know, some overpopulated area. care if the crawl sees me because he won't catch me but it's if the uh, if a walker spots me because they can haul ass alright so around here there appears to be a building I'm just curious if I can enter it or not won't know till I go look. I don't like this approach, you can't see anything. <coughs> Walker's coming my way, I don't see any sign of a, a, a water pump. I haven't really looked through the town. <laughs> very well but oh well let's move on at least my temp um, at least my uh, shakes have settled down a little bit temperature's gone right back up So, I wonder how far away from the coast I am. With any luck, we'll find a map. Or a GPS actually, because the GPS works the same way or a similar way. I haven't actually used one, so... Oh, 
Oh man. <coughs> I need to find some antibiotics. If I had a crew, I'd just save them and set up some sort of trade post and trade them off because they're fairly rare and would be worth quite a bit. So like, I would have stayed at the barracks for a better weapon but from what I've read is that the military weapons, you can only really find ammo for them at military areas so like <coughs> the airstrips and whatnot and bases. It's kind of uh You know what I mean? It's I could go grab like some silenced rifle, <laughs> pull it all the way back to uh civilization, run out of ammo, then I need to go all the way back to uh you know, resupply. But I don't know, I really haven't explored much of this area, like at all. I, it could be spread out quite a lot. I think I read there was like 50 towns in this game, which is quite a lot, and that doesn't include little uh, farmhouses and whatnot out in the middle of nowhere. I'm tempted just to sprint through this, but. Quite a bit of cover though. Actually, I want to try something. Okay. I was just curious if I could zigzag in case I get attacked by a sniper, and yes, I can. Did not know that. Oh, is that the coast? Yes, we made it! The sweet, sweet coast. That's something I really should do though. Uh oh, don't, don't tell me I'm getting disconnected. Well, just in case I do. There's been some errors where when you log on, you're out of food and water. Luckily I've got those coke, but if I run out of water and <coughs> I'm, you know, stranded here, I'm going to be in trouble. I don't want to go that way. I want to continue on down the coast. <coughs> I'm going to do it in cover of these trees. So at least we made it to the coast, now it's time to head back and hopefully we'll run into a, a few cities and see if we can find a map. So, wish me luck. <laughs>